You're under arrest. Also, that's the end of Chapter 3. We are on to Chapter 4, The Four Kings of Omi. All right. Also, have a good night, Flammy. Or good morning, I guess. Oh, what was that? あの、今は本町目の前で容疑者を殺されたのがそんなにトラウマになってるのか。まあな。でも今はもう関係ねえ。あんたと会うことももうないはずだ。待てよ。それがそうもいかねえんだ。あ？お前すぐに呼ばれてきたんだろ
ことが終わったら赤の他人分かっとるなあ,あまあ期待していてくれこの関西弁の男がゴーダリュウジ本人と思われますなるほどじゃあ4かと2かはこのもう一人の男が何者なのかを探ってるのかそうですこの男の正体を探り出し大海連合とつながっている組織を明らかにするのが狙いです会話の場所は全てのノイズを除去してみましたが場所の特定までには至ってませんで俺じゃなきゃできない任務ってのは何なんだ実は伊達さんにはこの男に近づいていただきたいと思いましてえこいつはそうです伊達さんもよくご存知です、right? カムロ町でスターダストというホストクラブを経営する男源氏名カズキですどうしてカズキを実は半年ほど前一度だけゴーダリュウジがカムロ町にやってきたことがありましてその時接触したのがカズキなんですだがそれだけでそれだけじゃないんです彼にはカズキという名前の他に別の本名がありまして本名ガンジンウ彼は歴史とした韓国人なんです伊達さんにはそれとなくカズキに近づいて揺さぶりをかけてほしいんです彼が韓国組織の構成員なのかどうかそれを探ってみてくださいあなたと彼の間には1年前の事件で培った信用がありますこれはあなたにしかできない任務なんですようん、mm. Interesting. Okay. Okay. Or that could do quite certain good. Oh, key ten no good. Coco might have a more dice over the do you got it. 傷害罪は表向きの口実あなたの身辺保護を頼まれたのよ身辺保護逃げようとしたら即座に逮捕するわせろどこを撃たれた,た大したことないわ。How did Kyo you not get hit by that? このままじゃ危険だ。おい、近くの病院はどこだソーテンボリ。何ソーテンボリにある。青いっていうスナックへ。She'll be fine. Tis but a scratch. Bar was called Owie. I better find it phase. You got it, dude. So I'm pretty sure I did find the little hospital. Like, I remember finding it. In fact, I think that's exactly where we're about to go. I wonder if it's in the same spot as it, I think it's in the same spot as it was in the previous game. I don't remember if it was called Owie in, in the previous game, but I do remember the hospital area being over here. Anyway, I don't see any sub stories on the map at the moment, so basically we're just going to focus on story until sub stories become a thing again. This must be the place you wanted me to find. You are the one who is the one who is the one who is そんなのことしたかてな。払えんもんは払えんよ。えあんたみかじめとりなんちゃうん。さやまかおるって女、知ってるな。かおるがどないしたんけがをしてる。どこにおるんや車に待たせてある。はよ連れてこんかいな。Why you leave her in the car? 
I didn't want to carry a bleeding woman around. Sorry. All right, back to the car. Get my bleeding homie. Double check. The map doesn't have any sub stories, right? I really didn't check the whole map, but yeah. I don't expect there to be a sub story during this sequence, so. Oh, if these motherfuckers want to throw down, I'm down. Look at y'all with y'all baseball bats. Think you can help yourselves. You crazy. Bitch. How dare you. Duh. So wait, who's the blue marker? This guy? Why are you marked in blue, huh? Is it because he's my my ally? I assume so. Oh god. Motherfuckers, you get away from that car. Just because you see a female passed out in that car does not mean you should be lingering around, you motherfuckers. Ow. How dare you? Don't be eyeballing my homie. My home girl. Alright, hurry and carry her to A. Some will decrease over time as you dash around town, running into people will also decrease your health, so carry her safety before her health is gone. If you get spotted by one of the many chat sends in Stormbird, you'll have to listen to their idle talk, which means don't run it. So fucking move and don't talk to me. Move and don't talk to me. Yeah, I get it. Cure you. If you fucking stop and talk, we're gonna get we're gonna be late. I'm running as fast as the game will let me. And I'm trying not to run into anybody. Especially not any of these chatty cathies. Oops. I didn't mean to bump into that guy, but we're good. We're here. We made it. Boy. Lay her down. Save her life. Do it. I'm sure I'd just be in the way in there. I'll check back in a few. Okay. So, you got a better idea? Ah, now we have sub-stories. Okay. One there, one there, one there, and one over there. So, there's four? Well, you know what we're doing. Also, hey, it's Ozzy. What's up, Ozzy? How you doing, man? I haven't seen you in a while. Also, are you important? Hello? Join us today. You won't regret it. No thanks. We'll start with this up story over here. Hello? Yo. Hold up, punk. Think you could go touching my babe and get away with it? Um, I didn't touch your shit, bitch. Take it easy, Hiroto. You probably didn't mean it. I ain't taking it easy. I saw this guy touching my sweet baby, Kathy, and he ain't getting away with it. Crazy for Kathy. Okay. Who the fuck is Kathy? Cool. Don't play dumb with me. I'm talking about this beaut you, man you just manhandled. I just waxed her down, too, with the best stuff money can buy. You think Kathy ain't worth that kind of money? Well, now you're making Kathy cry, asshole. How's it feel to be such a dick? What's that, Kathy? You're sad because this jerk don't know, don't think you're hot? There, there, shh. Big Daddy Hero is going to make it all better. You're going to pay for breaking my baby's heart. Kazu, give me a hand here. Come on, Hiroto. You really want to risk scratching the car in a scrap? Shut it. Ain't nobody lays a finger on my Kathy and gets away with it. Oh, God. Okay, ill-natured men. Sucks to be y'all. You picked the wrong fight today, good sirs. Anyway, you're prepping your trip to Mexico in about a week. You're going to be there till January 9th? Damn, you're going to be in Mexico for a while there, Ozzy. Well, hopefully it's a good, like a, like a, like a, a leisure trip more so than a, you know, hopefully it's not a, like, you're not going there for any particular, like, family emergency type reasons. But anyway, 
hope you're happy going there to have a good time and all that. I mean, even if you're going to see family, that's good. I did see your YouTube comment actually, Ozzy. So this is your this is your favorite uh, Yakuza game, huh? Wait, 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 sir, sir, sir. Have some trash. Fling him around. Ring around the rosy bitch or into the wall. That works too. Have some sword. You like cones? Hope you like cones. Somebody call a ambulance. I'm begging you. Sorry about all this, man. Roto's got a goddamn fool about this car of his. Maybe this will make him think twice before he throws a punch. Here, let me apologize to you. 20k, alright. Looks like you have your hands full keeping him in line. Good luck with that. Well, done with this bullshit yet? Maybe you should take some time off and... Huh? What's that, Kathy? You think I'm lame? Sorry, baby. Big Daddy Hero will be a better man from here on. Huh? Just give it a rest already. <laughs> Shit is silly. <sighs> All right. So you are your trip is family related, but it's not quite an emergency. It's just a family reunion, and you have to deal with your grandpa's ashes. Ah, okay. That's fair, Ozzy. Well, man. I mean, have a good time. Hopefully, you will. I'm about to go eat some Smile Burger personally, which is funny because I'm actually about to have burger for dinner whenever it's done. I can smell it cooking. It should be about ready by now. Or my sister's been cooking that shit for hours now. Anyway, I'm going to have a King Smile Burger, some Smile Fries, a Smile Shake, and a Smile Salad. Num nums. And I think just to cap off my, my, my hunger, let's throw in a fucking braised pork burger. And a, a, a teriyaki Smile Burger, and we're good. All right. Ooh, look at those experience counts right now, too. We got numbers. We got numbers, y'all. We should probably spend some of those numbers. Arigato. Yep, complete smile burger. Okay, we have confirmed that eating everything at every restaurant will get you more experience points. So that is confirmed. I figured it was, but now we've confirmed it 100%. All right, we could boost my light attack. That might actually be a good idea. Let me check the um, life skill list real quick. <gasps> I can do sprint. Ooh, I can do experience gain. Okay, we're going to do these first. Never mind. Do that. Do that. Worth it. Hunger gauge. That would have been a good one to get to, but I don't have enough. Some of these other ones we haven't actually unlocked, like, what the mini game is yet, so I'm not in a hurry to get them. I don't have enough blue and green to get any of this other shit. I don't have enough for my boosting and light attack anymore, but that's okay. It was worth it to get the experience boost stuff. Powerful throw? You know what? Let's learn this one finally. Yeah, I still have it on normal. If you recall, it's about this chapter after that you switch it to hard. You're still kind of fast after a point of normal. Well, the fight with Ryuji that I just had was actually not easy. But that could have just been because I sucked. I had to heal a bunch. Boost weapon attack damage. You know what? Let's do that as well. I actually ended up using a lot of weapons. Fuck it. Let's learn the taunt as well. It's not even expensive to learn. All right. Otherwise... I think I can't afford anything else other than stat boosts. So we'll just do a health. And as much boost and attack as I can do. And we'll go ahead and level up the limit gauge to the next level. Hell yeah. Don't mind if I do. Don't mind if I do. The heat gauge, not the limit gauge. But yeah. Alright. I think that's all I can afford for now. Looking good. Got my food in my system. Leveled up all the shit I could level up for now. Let's do another 
sub story, I guess. Oh, phone call. Hey, it's Daigo. Uh huh. Uh. How are things on your end, bro? We're okay for now. Chairman Goda's with me. We're heading toward Kamarocho by car. Good. How are you holding up, though? Hey, I'll make it. I'm not built like a built like a truck like you, but I can still take a punch. <laughs> Good to know. This alliance is in your hands right now. Yeah, I know. Later then. Okay. Should we go check on Popo Lady yet? I guess not yet. I'm sure the game will let me know when it's time. Wait, should I talk to these guys? Concept of the family, to what's known by the stakes, turn the hand. Oi, oi! Okay, just random, like, flavor text conversation going on. Okay. Oh boy. That didn't look glitchy at all. Also, nah. old man followed by two bees. Oh, sorry about that, friend. Y'all right? Uh. uh, I think I broke a bone. I should be asking you that. I'm fine, thanks. Mm. Glad to hear it. Maybe you ought to get yourself checked out just in case. Here's a little something to cover your doctor's visit. Fifty k. Okay then. Yeah. Uh. I need to go to the doctor. I'm I'm fine. <laughs> Don't be a stick in the mud, son. Consider compensation for me bump, my bump in India. So generous, a real philanthropist. See, just take it. Makes you look, makes me look good to the arm candy. By the way, name Shigeru Kanamatsu. What should I call you? I'm Kiryu. Kiryu on, huh? Well, if you start feeling pain after that fact, you just come find me. I'll cover all your doctor's fees, no problem. Well, take care. Where to? Kanamatsu-han. Let's see, how about an arcade? I'm feeling like going a few rounds in Virtua Fighter. <laughs> Tell you what, if you beat me, I'll give you some spending money. Ooh, you're on. Let's go, let's go. You must be pretty well off. Well, I'm sure we'll run into him again. Probably at the arcade. Maybe we'll fight him at Virtua Fighter. That'd be hilarious. And yeah, this game is very beautiful, dude. And it runs very pretty well on this engine as well. I agree with that wholeheartedly, uh, Ozzy. This game is gorgeous. The re the remix the remakes of these areas of the of the earlier game are fucking gorgeous. Anyway, here's another sub story. What up, bitches? Ow, I think my rib's broken, man. Pardon? We hardly nudged each other. Hey, that's a fancy pin on your lapel. You government man? You probably wore some serious cash. Fancy suit, nice hair. Can't you spare a couple of G's for my hospital bill? That's funny because we just dealt with this exact opposite thing. That guy's about to fall for a classic scam. Maybe I should step in. Do it. Boy. I think we've heard enough. Who the hell are you? I'm just trying to get what I deserve from this tightwad of a government fat cat here. With the help of pay his share, I'd be happy to beat it out of you. Huh. So much for the broken rib. Come on, then. You're about to have all the broken ribs now, bitch. Oof. Sucks to be you, sir. They were cones! Oh, no! Doesn't that just suck to be you, Horuichi? Come here, you whore. I was gonna cone him. I was gonna cone him. For that? Oh, it won't let me throw him into the taxi. Ah, oh, man. Well, he's done. Still want that money? Uh, I'm good. Later. I would have been quite a conundrum had you not come along when you did. You've done the country a favor. This man is Counselor Saeki of the National Diet, and I'm Mita, his, his aide. We're here in Osaka on business, but it seems rude street punks are a universal issue. Well said, sir. Mitsukun, give this man a copy. Very well, sir. Hmm? What's this? 
your copy of Council of Saiki's magnum opus, You Unleashed, is currently a nationwide bestseller. It is a resplendent work of the esteemed counselor to show the world that there is more to life than the, trampings, the trappings of great wealth. You flatter me, Mita. In stores, this book would run at least 5,000 yen. But to thank you for your kindness, I've just handed you a signed copy, free of charge. My apologies. I know it isn't much. No need to be modest, counselor. Any man would feel blessed to have the wisdom contained within you unleashed thrust into his hands. Okay. Uh, thanks. Hope we cross paths again someday. You'd have to tell me what you think. So this thing's really a bestseller? I guess I could skim it. There's not a single original thought in here. It's all just common sense, self-help fluff. <clears throat> Do people really buy into this garbage? I don't know. Uh, that sub story did not say complete, so there must be another step to that one. Uh, anyway, I don't see any more sub stories on this side. There is this one, and this one. Okay, so this must be the one I just did. This must be the guy that went to the arcade, and this is another one. So, I guess I'm gonna just go, I'm gonna go I'm gonna go this way. By the way, I got more locker keys that I haven't used yet. How many more are left? Stamina and Spark. Stamina and Royale. Stamina and X. Bulletproof vest, motherfucker. And another toughness. We're down to five keys missing. I guess it's this right over here. We can do the other sub story over here. Or I can answer the phone first. It's me from Owie. Oh, uh, hi. How's she doing? Calm down, finally. Medicine's doing its job now, so she's napping. That's good. Anyhow, sorry to bother you, but do you think you could pick up some more bandages, sugar? Sugar? I'm out, and this thing opens up again? Yeah, no problem. I'll pick some up on my way back. You're a doll. Talk to you soon. Okay. We gotta make sure we get some bandages. You got it, game. A little anecdote you have back when you think Zero had just come out. You were sick of hearing people praise Yakuza 2 to high hell. It was all such an improvement in the first game that they didn't change the fact that the PS2 games were beyond jank. Well. Uh... I don't really know the order of the release for all the games. I just know that this game is like the most recent one until Yakuza 7 just came out. That's all I know. I guess the I guess the uh, sub story must be inside the bar. It is. Hello, sir. You okay there, buddy? My head. It's itching like a mofo. That's what happens when you don't bathe for a month. That's probably not healthy. Come on, don't leave me hanging. Give me a witty comeback. Real zinger. Um, I don't do that on command. Uh. So not funny. Sorry, comedy isn't really my thing, and I wasn't expecting to be put on the spot. See you later. Wait, man. I ain't talking about you. I'm saying I'm not funny. That's why I can't get any good comebacks out of people. My setups are all cow dung. You're not wrong. That's, uh, real honest to you. Anywho, sorry to get all up in your business about it. The name's Minamizawa. I'm Kiryu. Listen, Kiryu-san, me and old, an old buddy of mine used to be part of a knee-slapping comedy duo called the Mars Fighters. Dash, you heard of us, though. Yak never got off the ground. It's a comedy style called Manzai, where I played the funny guy and my bud Kitagawa was the straight man. Uh. Yeah, never heard of you. Oh. Well, the reason I'm so down is, you see, the Grand Prix of Gags is right around the corner, but my buddy up and quit on me the other day. Maybe the cops wheeled him off. Guy had more porn stinking up his place than every sex shop in town. That's gross, man. Oh. Or maybe aliens beamed down and messed with his brain. Probed him real good, if you know what I mean. Oh, those, these are jokes. Uh. I'm really not funny, huh? I, to I tossed my life aside for a career in comedy. Dreamed of being a star act since I cracked my first pun but now my partner's gone and I don't think I've got the chops to go solo 
My setups are garbage. This isn't what the rock at the bottom feels like, eh? That's no joke, bro. Uh, maybe you should find a new career. <laughs> Can't give up now. If you don't, if you don't want to give up, then you've got to try harder, right? Mm. Yeah, that ain't half wrong. The jokes are in my bones, and it's no use trying to bury them. Maybe I can still make my break, my big break. I just need a new straight man for my act. What do you say, Kiryu-san? How about you partner up with me? Now that's a good joke. Ha, <laughs> ha, joke, yeah. Anyway, thanks for hearing me out. Think I'll stick around here and wet my whistle a little bit longer. Good luck in the grand, good luck in that Grand Prix. Thanks, man. Okay. Um. I mean, we can get a little drunk, get crunk. Just saying. Oh, I see. You don't want to overfill your bladder with alcohol. I just realized. You know what? That's fine. Fill it up. Be drunk as fuck right now. Oh my god. When you're drunk in this game, you actually start wobbling around. That's hilarious. Instead of the screen getting all blurry, it actually is wobbling around the walking. That's pretty funny. Can I run? Oh shit, hold on. You! You think it's okay to glare at a guy like that? Well, it ain't. I wasn't glaring at anyone, sir. I saw those furred ass eyebrows. Don't think wearing a suit's gonna get you off the hook. Calm down, you're imagining things. Oh, and now you're making fun of me, huh? I ain't gonna stand for this. Hope you're ready to get a taste of my fists. Sorry, I'm not hungry. <laughs> well then. So yeah, that was a good question. Why would porn be illegal? But apparently porn was illegal in Japan at some point, I guess. Also, I think uncensored porn specifically is would be illegal too. Since most of the porn that comes out of Japan has the blurriness over the genitalia. Or at least the female genitalia. Not that I've ever watched anything like that. Wink, wink. <laughs> Wait, cool your jets, no more. Oh, I see. This is his straight man, isn't it? Hey, what's Kitagawa? What did you call him? Kiryu-san, this guy's uh, my ex-partner, Kitagawa, from the Mars Fighters. <laughs> Minamizawa? The hell's got into you? Kitagawa, you're acting like a dumbass thug. Uh, no time to talk. Gotta run. you son I'm slower than molasses going uphill you mind chasing that fool down for me seriously fine but I'm drunk as fuck right now hey slow down don't hurt me why'd you dart off like that Kitagawa boy he asked you a question or do you need help finding the words oh, yeah. I'll talk give it to me straight Kitagawa why'd you end up uh, why'd you up and disappear on me your setup suck harder than a cheap hooker man you don't give a guy anything he can work with Damn, dude. Analogy aside, he's got a point. Can't say I didn't realize it. Ain't like my comebacks were much better. We got laughs, what, maybe once every show? I just don't think we're cut out for comedy, man. So that's why I quit. Kitago. Oh. Say, what did you get yourself into then? Why are you running around town acting like a Yakuza? After I quit, I found myself sipping iced tea in a manga cafe, trying to find some meaning in my life. Iced tea and manga? The hell's gotten into you? So I read this epic story about this manly Yakuza. But when I finished reading it, I just felt empty, you know? So I thought, maybe I'd become Yakuza myself and the story would never have to end. Man, you're dumber than a sack of bricks. That ain't a reason to turn into a life of crime. Wake up. Oh, shit. <laughs> Got him. Ouch, man. Don't hit me like that. You ruin a face made for showbiz. More like a face made for mugshots. 
Ah, uh, you got it knocked out. My, knocked my toupee out of place. Wait, you're bald? You know, feels like we never broke up. This feels just like it did back when we were on stage. Huh? Hey, hold up. Huh? Ain't this good? What, that dish rag on your head? It's like shit if you ask me. Nah, I'm talking about this dynamic, can you feel it? Oh. Actually, I'm playing the funny guy to your straight man. You're right. We were trying to make the, me the funny guy, but it turns out you're the way better at it. And you're the straight man. Those are some ferocious comebacks, by the way. I can almost feel my hair coming back. That ain't hair. That's confidence, buddy. Your hair's a lost cause. <laughs> we're gonna rock at the Grand Prix. Romance. <laughs> Listen to that music, though. Kitagawa, you really think we could do it? Ain't a doubt in my mind. The Mars fighters are back, baby. Can't thank you enough, Kiryu-san. This is all because of you. If you hadn't pushed me out the door of that sad-ass bar, I might have kissed comedy goodbye forever. And if you hadn't scrambled my brains with those fists, I wouldn't be half as funny as I am now. You're the one who started the fight, Twinkle Toes. I do believe you owe the man an apology. <laughs> Guess you're right. Sorry, man. Ugh, you never change. This time, I quit. Hold the phone. We just got back together. Yeah, and I'm regretting my life choices. That's all. Thanks for tuning in. You know, they're not half bad. Even Kiryu almost smiled. Almost. Almost. <laughs> um, I mean, the store for the bandages is right here. We might as well pop in and grab that shit. Let me get some of them bandages, homie. Bandages. Thank you. Arigato. All right. I guess we'll head over to the arcade then. If I can even run straight. Goddamn. The drunk, <laughs> drunken cure you running around is hilarious. He's too drunk. Wait, I got to save this lady over here. Hold on. Hello. Would you like to fight me, delinquents? So yo, easy peasy, y'all. Silver plateau. Anyway, in about five, maybe ten more minutes, I'm going to go get that food I've been talking about this whole stream. My sister took her sweet-ass time cooking that shit, but anyway, apparently it's almost ready. But let's check out the Club Sega thing with this dude who probably wants to play me at Virtual Fighter right now. What up, dog? Kiryu-san. If it ain't Kiryu-han, hope you're feeling better. Cool. Huh? You're that old man I bumped into with the uh, deep pockets. You like video games, son? I'm hooked on Virtual Fighter myself. Though I'm not so keen on losing. I indulge when I can, I guess. <laughs> Sounds a bit weak, my boy. I've poured 300 grand into this machine, and that's just today. That's uh, a lot of money. Uh, 300 grand can barely keep the lights on in my foyer. Must be a big room. <laughs> right you are. Anyway, I've been at it all day, and now I want to spice it up a bit. I'll put 10 grand on the line if you're game. Virtual Fighter 2.1 is my current addiction. Right now I'm on a three round winning streak. Beat my streak and I'll fork over the cash. Sound good? Let's do it. Sure, why not? Hope you're ready to lose. I suck at Virtual Fighter. Here we go. All right, last time I played as Kage, I'm gonna play you know what? I'm gonna play as motherfucking wolf, baby. Fight one, ready, go. Gotta remember my my punches and kick buttons. Ow! Loud, no, bad loud. Stay down. All right, next round. Suck it. Alright, that's two down. 
I just wanted to hear his wolf celebration for winning. Get some, Sarah. Get some. Bitch. No, ring out. Fucker. I got myself in bad spot. My bad. Damn it. Get up. No. 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 I lost already. God damn it. I already lost my money for losing. Well, I got her out of the ring at least. Or did I just lose money because I put another quarter in? I don't even know. Oh, bitch getting slammed. Get it. Ow. Oh, stop it. No! Come on! I suck at Virtual Fighter so hard. I also think Virtual Fighter just kind of sucks in general. I'm going to be, I'm gonna be real. Fucking stay down, ho. Stop it, Shun. Damn it. Damn it. Damn it, fucker. got him. Yeah, Virtual Fighter's jank and really easy to break once you know how. It's not the best fighting game. I agree. I feel like I used to know how back in the day on like OG Virtual Fighter. Or maybe it was, a, it was the second one for sure. It was the one that this is based on right here. This is definitely like a smoothed out version of the original Virtual Fighter 2. Because I remember all these characters. Also, suck it. Knocked him out of the ring. That was hilarious. Okay, so I think I have to win this to get where I need to be streak-wise. Because I fucked up by losing on that second round. Or wait, he said beat his streak, didn't he? Well, either way, I gotta win this one. No, she's too fast! Ow. Computer's too good at the video game. And I like... I don't really want to... I don't want to start from the first... I want to start from the... I want to start from the first guy. Alright, fuck it. Let's pick another character. Just fucking mix it up. You know, let's be the drunk guy. I remember liking using him back in the day. Oops, wrong button. I gotta remember how to hit people while they're down. That's one way to do it. Okay. Let's try to figure out how to do the leg drop while they're down. Okay. That's one way to do an elbow drop while they're down as well. Excellent. Okay, I whoop the shit out Here we go. Ow. Fucking Sarah. Ya bitch. Damn, Sarah hits way harder than fucking Shun does.
Damn it. Well, if I lose this... Oh, I did not lose yet. But if I lose this, I'll restart again. I'll pick somebody else. I don't really like using this guy now. I like his moveset, but his moves are weak. Haha, <laughs> spam the shit out of her, got her. Alright, we got through two, we're good. The shadow match, uh oh. Oh sh my goodness! Jesus. The amount of damage you did to me already though, sir. No, he got me. I really don't block. I'm gonna block more. Damn it. Woo! Got him. That was close. I was close. I was close. All right. I got to win this one right here. I got to win this one. Oh, no. Got me with the grab, though. Damn it. I forgot I could just like fall on the ground. That was silly. Oh, the backflip kick. What a bitch. Damn it. Damn it. Oh my god, I'm gonna fucking. I'm not gonna be able to beat this bitch. Oh my. Fucking booted my ass. Oh my god. I don't really want to do this one right now. I want to go eat my burger, man. I'll come back to this. I don't want to do this right now. Wait. Did I win? You're supposed to be making me look like... Did I tell you I love this game? Oh. Did I do... I'm confused. He said beat his three man, his three, I don't know, whatever. If you're a real Virtual Fighter fan, shouldn't you be glad I took the game seriously? I'll put it another way. Would you have felt good about winning if you knew I held back? Huh, you got a point. A victory like that ain't a victory at all, really. Terribly sorry for getting upset, Sure, you Han. Here, take this as a way of apology. 100k? Nice. Dude is hooking it up. Well, suppose I ought to be shoving off. Take care, Kiryu Han. I'll be studying my moves. Uh. Yeah, later. Okay. I guess we'll come back to him another time and play him some more? I, Or maybe? I don't know. Either way, good times. And we back from my food break. Okay, so. We left off, we just played Virtual Fighter and apparently did finish the quest that I thought I wasn't going to finish. So that's good. Now we need to go over here, because apparently there's two... Uh, both of our sub-stories that are open are both over here now. On this bridge. So let's do that. The slightly drunken Kiryu runs as fast as he can over to here. Oh, look. It's Rich Man again. Hey, what's going on here? <clears throat> nice to see you, Kiryu, huh? This rat here is trying to weasel his way out of paying me back what he owes. Please, I just need a little more time. I'll pay you back as soon as I can scrape the cash together. I'm barely getting food on the table right now, man. <clears throat> I don't give a damn. Huh? You're gonna get my money. 
and I don't care if you gotta sell your house to do it. Jeez, Kanamatsu is laying it on pretty thick here. Intervene. I can't let Kanamatsu treat this guy like this. So what's it gonna be, Junior? You paying up? Boy. Hey, he said he just needs time. Would it hurt you to give him that? It's not like you need the cash. Kill you, huh? Please, at least until tomorrow. I swear on my life. Fine. I'll let you off the hook for 24 hours. But if you don't get my money, there will be hell to pay instead. Actually, I got a better idea. If you can't pay me, I'll take what you owe me from Kiryuhan here instead. Cool. Huh? What do you mean? Sorry, but that's what you get for opening your big mouth. Should have known what you're getting into. Besides, now I got insurance in case our friend here tries to skip town. I ain't running. I'm gonna pay. You heard the man. But then it's settled. Remember, 24 hours. Meet me back here when you get it. Or else. One way or another, you're paying up. <clears throat> Why is that guy such a dick all of a sudden? Thank you so much, sir. I'm Takeda. I was weighing whether it'd be safer to jump into the river than deal with him. Nani? Nani? You're serious? I am. Kanamatsu's real cruel, let me tell you. I, am I borrowed 500 grand from him when the factory I would run was at risk of going under. Every bank I tried was shutting me out. But I realized quick as a whip how I had spat I screwed up. It wasn't long before 500k turned into 3 mil. How's that even possible? Hi. Beats me. He started making threats at that point. Said he'd take my factory if I didn't pay up. You really did that? It's alright. I got a big order coming in tomorrow, so I should be able to get him off my back. It's how I'll live afterwards that I'm worried about. Anyways, I'd better get to work. I should probably see how this ends. So clearly Kanematsu or whatever is a fucking loan shark. Now we know how he got his money. Alright, anyway, what up, dude? <clears throat> I guess this is the end. Huh? What's wrong, bro? Hey, is something wrong? Yeah. Nah, it's nothing. Don't go troubling yourself over me. <sighs> Tell me what's going on. Sometimes that helps. I'm just tired. Tired of being who I am. Tired of this life. I screwed up real bad, and it cost my job. And as soon as the cash started drying up, the wife walked out on me. Thought about going after her, but I was too much of a freaking coward. Hell, I don't even got the courage to end my pain. If only I could turn my life around, or even just find a shred of confidence. Got any ideas? Pitiful, right? Here I am asking some guy on the street if he can't turn my life around. He can't get more pathetic than this. Huh. Something that would help him change his life. Maybe that ridiculous self-help book I got from the counselor, Saeki, would be just what he needs. Not like I would ever read it again, anyway. Take it, bro. I don't want it. Huh? Huh? What's this? Apparently one of the most popular books in the country. I don't know if it'll help, but it might be worth giving it a read. Oh! I've heard of this guy. This is Counselor Saeki's new book. I've been looking for a copy for weeks. Hey, um... I'm Yoshida. Are you, you are? Kiryu. I can't thank you enough, Kiryu-san. You were the only guy who stopped to talk to me, and now this? My new life starts today. I gotta get home and crack this baby open. Glad I found someone who can appreciate that book more than I do. Okay, then. Now, where did the sub-story take me? Back over to the counselor guy? All right. Let's, yeah, let's do these sub-stories before I focus on the story again, the main story. So we'll hot-foot it over to the other side over here as quickly as possible. I'm not going to be quite as vigilant for shinies anymore. If I happen to spot one, that's good. I'm pretty sure I've explored the majority of this town. I'm sure there's nooks and crannies I missed and or buildings I haven't gone into, but because I'm still missing a few locker keys. But yeah. Oh man, you're in the way. Oh no, they're not. I went the wrong way. Oh well. Fight him anyways. Damn, y'all got fucking sweeped across the fucking street, bro. That's what they call the street sweeper. <laughs> 
street sweeping, motherfucker. Hot shit. We're going down, down, baby. Low street in a Range Rover street sweeper, baby. Cock ready to let it go. Who doesn't love some Nelly? All right, anyway. You. I told you to back off. Mm. Huh? Oh, no. Oh, how I enjoy these cute little outbursts. Your every breath sets my heart aflame, you know. I said no. Come on, sweetie. You know, money is no object. Just give me a number and it's yours. A million? Five mil? Or would a hundred mil do it? I wouldn't go with you for all the cash in the world. Now get your stinking breath out of my face already. Young lady, do you know who you're addressing? You should be honored. Oh, I know damn well who he is. A sex star politician who thinks his fame buys him action. Oh, uh, Mika? Uh, it's you. Mm -hmm. Oh? Keep walking, cue ball. Can't you see the lady and I are trying to have a conversation here? That's... That's... Spit it out, you dunce. Otherwise, move along. <clears throat> that's my wife, damn it. Huh? huh? What's gotten into you? Don't worry, Mika. I won't let this old fogey lay a finger on you. When did you get so confident? It's like you're a different man. <gasps> Seems our playtime has hit a little snag. Mita, sir, teach this miscreant what happens when you cross me. Very well, sir. It would be my pleasure. Wait. Oof. How exquisite. There's more where that came from. What happened to the tough guy act? <laughs> Damn it. I can't let this continue. Hey, you want someone to play tough guy, I'll oblige. You're the guy from the bridge. So our friend has a knight in shining armor, eh? Huh. You seem familiar somehow, but no matter. I'll take you do I'll take you both down. Okay. Get fucked, glasses, man. Yoshida's gonna help us? I don't need no stinking help. Get fucked. <laughs> Just kicking this fucker all around the damn street. Get fucked! Give him that good old ring around the rosy throw. Bitch. Bitch. Oh, you want to fucking throw, huh? I don't think so. Also, I like that uh, he got the last hit in, not me. Forgive me, counselor. It seems I was outmatched. You okay, honey? Mika, oh, I did it. Oh, come on. You only won because this guy was fighting. I gotta give you credit, though. You stood your own your ground for me, and I admit that felt good. That old perp didn't do anything to you, did he? Nah, I'm fine. Hey, ain't that Saiki, the bigwig government author? Typical politician, just another creepy slime ball. How truly touching. Here, I trust this will be enough to ensure you don't breathe a word of this to anyone. Uh huh? Isn't that a bribe? Oh, no, no, no. I simply have no need for it. After all, as I say in my national best-selling book, there's more to life than money. <laughs> Come along, Mita. We'll be going now. Yes, sir. <clears throat> Thanks for coming along when you did. The guy started handing me in a bar, and then he wouldn't take no for an answer. I gotta wonder, though. Where'd all that courage come from? I ain't never seen you so fired up. Well, I was drowning my sorrows over on Ewao Bridge when this guy here came and made some time for me. I admit, I was almost at the end of my rope, but he cheered me up by giving me a copy of that bestseller, You Unleashed. I ran home, cracked it open, and it turns out the whole thing's chock full of cliche bullshit. Be better off as toilet paper. I'm practically laughing my ass off by the end. That trash ain't bestselling quality at all, I tell you what. Got me thinking though, there ain't no rhyme or reason to life. You just gotta roll with the punches. And if that waste of ink could succeed, then why couldn't I? Felt my confidence come flooding right back. Well, get a load of this. That guy who was creeping on me, he's the one who wrote that book. Wait, really? 
You gotta be joking. I ain't. That pervy old bag of bones was Counselor Saki. <laughs> what are the chances? That's a right. It's a crazy world we live in. <laughs> Only makes me feel more confident knowing that windbag struck it rich on that BS. Oh, you're big time, man. This never would have happened if you hadn't stopped to talk to me. Say, will you let me treat you to dinner? I'll pay you for with it. Pay for it with that stack of cash that old Letcher gave me. Sorry, I got some business to take care of, but you enjoy a nice dinner with your wife. Good idea. Well, here, I won't be needing this. You take it. Uh, what did he give me? Oh, he gave me the gun. Uh, I'll get rid of this sword, I guess. Thank you again. Bye now. You two watch each other's backs, okay? And that one is done. All right. That was an interesting, like, arc of a story. First we met the counselor, then we met the guy on the bridge who wanted the self-help book. Then we found the counselor hitting on his wife. Crazy Yakuza twist of fate that it always seems to be. You know what? I'm going to save this person. Hold on. We got them tugs. See ya, tugs. You might not want to get back on your feet after a little bit of that action, son. Oh, okay. 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 More purple buns. Thanks for the purple buns. Even if they weren't so great. They taste like pork and meat and something. Alright. Just trying to get back over to the bridge to get to this other sub story where we can check on this guy who's supposed to pay the debt for the douchebag loan shark man. Oh, I have to fight them? Fine. Ooh, okay, okay. Okay, Hino. See ya! <laughs> Whoop! Sweep the leg, Kiryu! Sweep the leg! Ooh, see ya. I got one fucking flopping around like a jellyfish. Alright. You, motherfucker. Well, if it ain't cute, you on. Seems our now mutual friend from the factory is a no-show. I'm guessing he skipped town. So, are you ready to pay with that three mil he owes me? Or do I gotta start charging interest on you too now? Hold on, I got the money. Mm -hmm. Huh? This. This is all of it. I'll be the judge of that. It's all here by my count. Here I thought you'd packed up and flew the coop. I'd be lying if I said I hadn't considered it. But I couldn't leave it on Kiryu-san. Not after he stepped in to help me. Thanks again, Kiryu-san. I might not have a single yen to my name anymore, but I'm going to work hard to rebuild my life from the ground up. Good luck. I'm sure it won't be easy. But honest work has a way of paying off. Hi. Hey. By the way, I want you to have this. It ain't much, but it's something. Oh, look, a silver plate. Take care, Kiryu-san. Ha! Huh. Guy showed up in the nick of time. You're lucky, Kiryu-han. I was getting ready to collect on you. You really didn't trust him? The only thing in life I trust is a balanced checkbook. Words of spit. If you can't back him up with cash, what good are you? Words are wind, bitch. But I got my cash back. All's well that ends well. Right. By the by, the by I can't tell you ain't lo I can tell you ain't local. You from Tokyo? Yeah. Funny enough, I was looking at some land developments in that area. Heard of that new Kamarocho Hills they're building. I got my scoop in on up. Scoop it on up. Good move, right? Nutty. You can afford the whole thing? Mm. Of course I can. Ain't it amazing what you can do with a little green? Men are on the cogs of society. Money's the oil that keeps them on churning. 
As long as you got the grease, you decide how fast the cogs turn. Power, freedom, sex. It all boils down to cold, hard cash. I wouldn't say I agree. Eh, come talk to me when your bank account has a few more zeros. You'll change your tune. <laughs> well, as they say, time is money, and there's another poor sap who's late on his payments. See you around, Kiryu Han. Wow. Guy ended up being a loan shark dickbag. Wow, we're not done with him yet either. Wow, 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 wow. <sighs> okay, well, now we're gonna go to the south side and watch him fuck somebody else over, I'm, I'm assuming. Or maybe they're gonna fuck him over and we have to help him. That would be more hilarious, actually. Wait, can I get over there right now? Oh, I have to go. I have to go this way. You'll never catch me alive, motherfuckers! You'll never catch me alive! Kiryu can run pretty goddamn long before he gets tired. Alright, here he is. What's up, douche? Hey, bud, can you spare some chip? Oh my god. He lost all his money. Even 100 yen would do me, doing me a solid. Huh? Kanamatsu, is that you? Oh, if it ain't Kiryu, huh? Of all people to see me like this. What happened to you? Remember when I told you I was going to buy up Kamrocho Hills? Uh. Yeah, something about buying the whole development. Well, one of my lady friends had a connection to a real estate company who said they had deeds. And... <sighs> poured every last yen into that deal. Turns out it was one big scam. Company didn't even exist. Top of that, my lady friend was in on the whole thing with the jackass running the show. Guess they were lovers or something. Anyway, <sighs> I lost everything. I'm bankrupt, broke, and burning trash to stay warm on the streets. Sorry to hear that. This is what I get for trusting people. Kill you, hon. I know it was a stingy piece of work, but I could really use some cash. Even 100 yen would go a long way. Can't remember the last time I ate. I'm starving. Ah, but he was also a relentless loan shark. What should I give him? Here, have... You know what? I can spare 10k. He gave me a lot more than that. Here. But, are you sure? I'm sure. Let it be a lesson to you about trust. Th thank you so much, Kiryuhan. I'm so ashamed I could cry. This ain't much, but I want to show my appreciation. Here, take this. Strength ring. Okay. <sighs> you know, I was a damn fool prancing around like some kind of celebrity with all those girls and making honest fellows' lives harder. But when my own money dried up, all my friends scattered like spiders in a flood. Money changes people, you know? Change me, that's for damn sure. You gotta be careful out there. Don't let money get to your head. Uh. That's exactly right. Took this for you to see it, but you've really come around, Kanamatsu. <laughs> <laughs> Guess I have. It cost me millions, but the lesson I've learned was worth it. Worth it at least that. It was worth at least that. And now I've got nothing to lose. I'm gonna live my life to the fullest. Find some pure happiness, untainted by money. As passionate about things as you are, I'm sure you can pull it off. Good luck, Kanamatsu. Thank you kindly, Kiryu Han, for everything. Take care of yourself now. I wonder if he would have got pissed if I only gave him 100. He would have been like, what? You only gave me 100 after all I did for you? Blah, 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 blah. Too late to know now, but I wonder if that's what he would have done. All right, well, anyway, I think that's all for the sub-stories that I have on the map for the moment. Looks all clear to me. So, back to the main story, shall we?